Hi friends, in this video let's see how to use SSIS Dataflow task to import Excel file into SQL Server table. So let's add new SSIS package and go to a control flow task and data flow task and drag that into package designer. Now open data flow task and drag source assistant to the designer. Now select Excel type and new and click OK. Now select Excel file path that is customers.xlsx and open. Now click OK. Now open Excel source and select your table that is customers. And now go to columns. Make sure all are selected and click OK. So now we have defined Excel source type. Now go to other destinations and select OLDB destination. Now map this and go to OLDB destination and then click new. So select existing or create new. So my server name is localhost and my database name is SSIS practice. Click OK and click OK. So now I want to create a new table that is new. So I want to create a table name as Excel customs. And check verify the data types are compatible with SQL Server version or not. So NVAR care, so all are NVAR care, which are correct, right? So now click OK. So it's created a new table in our database and selected our mappings. So make sure all are selected, all are mapped. Click OK. Now execute the package. So total 403 rows are in source. So all rows are loaded into our table. Stop the execution and go to our database, Object Explorer and refresh our tables. So you will see Excel customers. Now select Excel customers. So it is showing our data. So this is how we use SSIS data flow task to import Excel data into a table. Thanks for watching my video. If you like this video, please like, share, comment, or subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching my video again.